We are ready tonight to kick things off with yet another edition of SmackDown Live. The arena sold out, tensions at an all-time high, and all roads lead to the pay-per-view. Why waste time? Let's get it started now. First match of the night, here we go. Tag team match on the way. Buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. I have a feeling this will be a match to remember. He's held dozens of championships, competed in countless main events, and owns the greatest streak in WWE history. The Undertaker is here. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Every WWE competitor is spectacular to watch, but when The Undertaker competes, it's an event. Well, he's got the most awe-inspiring entrance in WWE history and has the in-ring dominance to back it up. Beautiful side Russian leg sweep. When the bells hold and the flames of hell burn, that means the man known as the Lord of Darkness, the Dead Man, and the Phenom is on his way. The Mighty Undertaker is the greatest force in this industry and the collector of souls. Fireman's carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. You never know when evil will appear, Byron. We witnessed that when Undertaker emerged from the darkness for the 900th episode of SmackDown Live. It was here the dead man proclaimed he was back to taking souls and digging holes. The Undertaker is the Reaper. This giant possesses powers that extend far beyond our mortal world. And if forced to, he will unleash those powers to bring your soul with him to the dark side. Welcome to Death Valley. Trap the arm. Boom. This might be it. Oh, my. Uh oh, no, don't do this. I got right to the gut. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Right, he's got him here. He's got him on the sidewalk. Slam! Almost drove him through the ring. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them work well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bachwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Oh boy, he is rolling. He wants no part of the outside. 
Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sport. Submission move coming up. Cross pressure. That could be a game changer. Whoa, he gets out of it. He's at another level right now, Michael. Oh, Aiden English saw that one coming. Oh, nasty impact. AJ Styles moved out of the way. Man. Goes down hard. What a stop. Good grief. Aiden English turns it around. Trap the arm. Into the neck breaker. I think AJ Styles is done playing. He's looking at it. Nothing quite like the phenomenal forearm. He hit it. This could be it, guys. Here's a cover. Digging deep for a kick out. Yeah, it's going to take more than that to keep him down. AJ Styles is looking to fly. Look at this! Here he goes. Styles looks like he wants to do it all by himself. Is he done? Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Call me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. Oh, hang on for dear life. He might have it. AJ Styles beginning to breathe. Oh, wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. You better hope this stamina holds up. Whoa, Aiden English able to avoid damage. Nelson reverse slam. That could be it, guys. Aiden English is rolling now. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. It's dangerous. He's about to get back. Aiden English is going in for the kill. Beautiful technique. But I don't know. Here's the cover. A lot of damage taken out by Rusev. I'm not sure how this will pan out. Unless this thing turns around here, this tag team match is all but over. So many bad things can happen outside the ring. And given his condition right now, he really needs to keep it inside the ring if he wants to. They're going to lock it in. He's not going to like this. AJ Styles is getting nothing quite like the phenomenal forearm. He hit it. That should do it. AJ Styles shoulders down. Is it enough? Two, three. They did it. And here's another glance at these superstars in action. Man, this was great. Ain't nothing better than action like this. Here are your winners, The Undertaker and the phenomenal AJ Styles. And there's your winner, be a pinfall. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. You got that right, partner. Again, huge win. Be ready for anything. We have triple threat action coming right up.
Mandy Rose has ascended the ranks in NXT and WWE so rapidly that she hasn't really encountered any rivals. But I like the idea of Rose taking out her former Absolution partner, Paige. I think Mandy Rose expected the red carpet to be rolled out when she joined SmackDown and saw Paige was the show's general manager. When that didn't happen, it made Rose red with anger. Aside from Saxton's commentary, this has all the makings of an epic match. Byron and I discussed the anger Mandy Rose is toward Paige, and I think she should realize that Paige chose her to come to Raw and form absolution. At some point, you need to stand on your own. Will the two of you please stop? Paige used Mandy Rose for her nefarious mean and then unjustly ignored God's greatest creation. I hope Mandy Rose unleashes her full fury on that ungrateful Paige. Surprising, Cole. When you're in the ring with two of the best women on the roster, you're going to take a few looks. That's just the way it is. Well, she's looked good up until now. She just has to make quick Prime cover by Carmella. And an early kick out in this unusual matchup. She's still in this one. Oh, oh, oh man! Carmella has eyes to finish. She better do something fast. She fights out, but that doesn't mean the damage wasn't already done, Michael. Slap! She's on the attack and on the move. You gotta believe this one's over. Harsh impact. Locked in. It's locked in. So impressive. And she lets her free, but the damage was certainly done, Michael. Carmella wants to settle the yeah. Man, she got her good there. Oh, no. Mandy Rose's chances in this one. There's a pin now. And a kick out. She came here to fight, not lay down. What a stop. Good grief. Cover here. And Mandy Rose gets out of the pinfall. Too soon. And Pin manages to reverse out of that one. Man, that is just careless intent. This battle's not over yet. Too soon. We're looking at complete domination yeah. here. A knee drop! <laughs> oh, man! Paige might get an early three count. Easily kicks out of that one. Gonna take more than that. Mandy Rhodes has been successful in WWE, but she also has the less than honorable distinction of being the first person eliminated in both the inaugural Women's Royal Rumble and Women's Elimination Chamber. She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. She's still in this one. Looking for the win. She better do something fast. Michael brought up Mandy Rose's lack of success in the Royal Rumble and the Elimination Chamber. But I have to say, she didn't have the luck of the draw in either case. Drawing spot number four in the Rumble and being the first person out of a pop. Look at Paige making her move. She better do something fast. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. At 2016's Clash of Champions, it was another classic triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship. It was Bailey versus the boss, Sasha Banks, versus the champion, Charlotte Flair. The match started out more like a singles match between the boss and the queen. Bailey learned very quickly it was every woman for herself. What does Paige need to do right now? I can tell you this is not how she envisioned this match going, guys. She's absolutely off. She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. 
What do you expect? Both of parents' performers in this business is in her blood. The triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship was another example of the incredible competition between the female superstars of WWE. Charlotte was physically dominant in fighting off the challenges of Bailey and Sasha Banks. And here we go for the win! One! You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. And she kicks out with relative ease. It'd take more than that. But she gets the pump silence. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. We've seen some unlikely alliances formed in these type of match. It's locked in. They tapped. They tapped. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. That's a woman on a mission. Here is your winner, the Princess of Staten Island, Carmella. Big win here to start the show. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. It will be Team Luke Gallows in a match of epic proportions. Big time matchup. This is it. Tag team action underway here, guys. There it is. It's locked in. Smart maneuver. Oh, close line. This tag team is just tremendous working together. Double teams. And it's about to get worse. Axe handle finds its target. Look at Luke Gallo starting to slow here. But he's not appearing too worse for wear. At least not yet anyway. It's no... He's looking at it. He looks to be losing a bit of leverage here. Out. He's not done just yet, Michael. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Hart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. A team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action like a singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I agree. A team needs one, and it should be something that can be administered to any opponent. That's when a finishing move is truly effective. And since we're talking about tag teams, remember you and your partner have until the referee's five count to execute the move. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. 
The rivalry between these women gets so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner, and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalya's power set the tone for the match and gave the team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence made the Irish grass kicker turn the tide and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish born superstar. Naomi did an excellent job of making sure any quote unquote committee nonsense cost her girls the match. Once Becky Lynch got Carmella locked in the disarmor, there was nothing for the Staten Island Princess to do but to tap out. And it didn't take long for that to happen. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partners. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. Taken off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Oh boy, he is rolling. Boom! Rocket kick. Huh? Boom! Rocket kick. He's in the driver's seat now. Can Rowan pull through? Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful. Here's the tag. Good job. And into a quick cover as he gallows. He might have it. And into a quick cover as he gallows. Precarious position here. Electric chair to the face buster. He gets it with a reversal. some of the action from the previous match. Check this out. Remember this? Here are your winners. Rowan and Harper. The Bludgeon Brothers. And that's a nice win for these two here tonight. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest. Be Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have seen Kara. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Man. Breaker. Got the shoulders down. And Steve Carl with a kick out. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Oh, 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 oh. We know what's coming next. Oh, boy, do we ever. 
Oh! I'm not sure how much he has left. He's in trouble. Randy Orton and all oh, tail! But he's got to capitalize now. Penny predicament. The cover. And this one's history. What a win. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. Oh, I can't believe this. Here is your winner. He is the Apex Predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. Okay, one on one at Chuck Vince. Oh, Corey. Ha 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 ha. I and like, you like this. this, right? Of course I do. God forbid we have a one on one match. These no. two guys can't stand one another. I like the aura. I like the air of danger around ringside. Anything can happen now. Yeah, this poor guy not only has to worry about his opponent in front of him, but the guy hanging out at ringside. There is no way this is fair. Our general manager needs to do something about this, and fast. This is mental warfare at its absolute finest. Was he just going to sit there and watch the match? Of course he is. Why would you doubt his motive? We should have bought a ticket then and sat in the stands. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Fisherman Driver! Good night. Snapmare. Nasty attack to the neck. Into the tie-up they go, but who's going to end up with the upper hand? Boom, what impact! Ooh, what impact! Defensive here. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark Lewis. Not much behind that pin attempt. Jeff Hardy was able to get out of the way there. Harsh impact. What a stop. Good grief. Nail it. Whipped into the corner. Man, he hit hard. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I knew this was coming. It was just a matter of time. Hey, there's still a match going on. These two are getting heated up right now. Well, the other guy should be thrown out of here. No reason to even be at ringside. And oh, what a right hand taking advantage. You knew this was going to happen.
Jeff Hardy was able to get out of the way there. struggling a bit here. This very well may be too much for him to handle. If he wants to win this thing, he's going to need to make some changes here. There's no way he can stay in this match if he doesn't find a way to fend off this attack. This match certainly isn't trending in the right direction for him. Beautiful technique. I knew it was only a matter of time. He's got some fight left in him. Almost showing the heart that won him the NXT Championship. Oh, this is dangerous right here. Here he goes. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Amazing action. Here is your winner, Jeff Hardy. And that's the win to start off the night. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action.
The Irish last kicker. The following contest is scheduled uh -oh. for one fall. Making her way to the ring. From Come on, we need to get over here. Now hold on, Cole. Let's just see where this goes. Sharp knee. Float over. Oh. And it was... Oh, what a giddy thing. Wow. What grace. Float over into the... Ooh, what impact. something like that. DDT! Planet! Becky Lynch may be starting to fade here. Here's what we're going to see what she's yeah. made of. If you're worried about oh. her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand so much more punishment than this. It's been quite the back and forth battle for these women, guys, and I'm willing to bet that's the way it's going to be the rest of the way. With all that build up, it's sad to see it end like that. This one is over. And it doesn't sound like the fans are too thrilled with the decision here. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered.
The man's looking a little bit shaken. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. You gotta believe this one's over. He's going for it all. Incoming. Eludes that one. Close line! And this one is over before it begins. If you ask me, the officials need to be a little more lenient with the rules when it comes to big matches like this.